Welcome back students. In this video, we are going to learn about ordering numbers. That means you uh, numbers in a sequence. Mein likhte hain. For example, ya to aap unko, uh, greater numbers se smaller numbers ki taraf leke jate hain ya aap unko smaller se greater ki taraf leke jate hain we are going to look into the examples as well and uh, let's start with our work so there are two types of sequences uh, that we can use in order to you know order your numbers for example the first one is ascending order Ascending order means that you have to arrange the numbers given from smallest to largest. All right. Likewise, we have another term that says descending order. Descending order means that you have to arrange the largest, uh, arrange the numbers from largest to smallest. You can see the example on the screen as well. For example, if I have a number one, two. 3 and 4 and I have to arrange these numbers so you can see if I say that these numbers kis arranged hai, it's actually arranged in the form of ascending order right and if we say that um, I have to arrange the same number in descending order that means that we will kis tarah arrange it in the same biggest number ko sabse pehle mention karenge. Then we'll write the smaller one and then we'll write the smaller one and the smallest one. All right. So these are the two terms that are used for ordering the numbers. Uh, we are going to do some of the examples in which uh, we'll discuss how to uh, place the different numbers in a place value chart. And then we are going to uh, order them according to the questions requirement. Okay. So we move on to our next slide. Par. Okay, before I start, let's uh, just write the numbers that we are going to uh, order over here. And uh, hum unko kis mein karenge? we are going to write over here that first of all, we are going to learn how to do the ascending order. Okay, so hum jo bhi numbers mein aapke saamne mention karungi, humne usko ascending order mein um, let's go sequence karna, 6 1 5 7 0 and then i have a number 5 3 2 3 1 and i have 2 3 4 5 1 and then the last number is 9 9 8 6 4 so these all are actually five digit numbers and what we are gonna do is that we are going to separately um, place these numbers in the place value chart that is uh, given over here so it will be easier for us to recognize which number is the smallest and which number is the biggest all right remember if we are doing the ascending order that means we are going to arrange them according to smallest to biggest okay So let's start putting the numbers. I'm going to put this number over here in the place value chart. 0, 7, 5, 1, 6. I am putting them uh, directly. I think we have already learned in the previous videos how to place these numbers in the place value chart. Okay. So next number is 5, 3, 2, 3, 1. So I'll write over here 1 is 1s, 3 is 10s, 2 is 100s. 3 and then 5. Then comes the number 23451 right over here. We are placing all the numbers one by one in the place value chart. You see that last number 99864 ko place karenge. So we write over here 9, 9, 8, 6, 4. Alright? Okay. So what do we do when we have to compare the numbers? We have to look at the number, that, uh, the place value that is the biggest one. So in this case, 10,000 is the biggest value over here. So we'll look 
over here and we see that there is a 6, there is a 5, there is 2 and there is 9. So which one of these numbers are the smallest? In this case, 2 is the smallest number. And then it tells us that the so smallest number is. So I am going to write the whole number over here first. Because I am arranging these numbers in ascending order. That is from the smallest to the biggest number. So we write the number here. Arrange karke, that is 2, 3, 4, 5, 1. Okay, then put the comma over here for the next value. Let's see, 2 ke baad kaun sa number bada hai? 5, 6 or 9? Yes, obviously 5 is the bigger one than the number 2. So, we mention 5 wala sara number par mention kar denge, and that is 5, 3, 2, 3, 1. Likewise, we we'll move to the next number and that is this one. We will write over here, it will be 1000. 570 and the last number we will mention in the last because it's the biggest number over here. So we will write over here 99,864. So this is how we arrange the example given over here in ascending order. Alright, from smallest to biggest. Now, now let's move to the next slide and in this slide we are going to uh, Solve the question using the descending order. Remember, descending order means from biggest to the smallest number. Alright? This means it means the biggest number comes the first, then comes the smaller number, and then comes the smallest number. Alright? So keep this in mind. Descending means that uh, we are coming from bigger side to downward. Think of it as a stair. When you stairs to the stairs, that means you are coming as a descending, as in you are descending from the stairs. And if you are um, getting up on the stairs, that means you are actually ascending up on the stairs. Okay. So let me show you over here. This is ascending and this is descending. Right now we are discussing the uh, example of descending order. Let's put some of the numbers over here and then place them in the value place value chart and then we'll discuss the answer. 12,285 then comes 99,000 then comes 96,000 232. Let's place these values one by one. 8, 5, 2, 0, 5. Then comes the next number. 1, 2, 2, 8, 5. Next number is this. I'm going to place it over here. 9, 9, 0, 0, 0. And then comes the next number that is 9, 6, um, 2, 3, 2. Alright, let's look over here on the 10,000th place value because we have to look at the biggest place value in order to uh, do the arranging part. So, this is the smallest value. De, small, sorry, this is the biggest value. De hai. Now, in this question, you are going to see that there are two biggest values over here. So, that means we cannot compare them because they are equal to each other. We are going to move to the next number that, that is the thousand place value and we are going to see which number is the biggest one. So, in this case, you can see this number is bigger because it has 9 it, in it and 6 means it's the lesser one. So, that means we are going to choose this number to uh, start with because this is the biggest number in the example. So, let's put the uh, number over here that is 99,000. Then comes, uh, since we are done with this number, we are going to move to the other thing. And that is 96,232. So this is smaller than the 99,000. So I'm going to place it next to it. Then comes the number uh, 
the one that had 8,000 in it and that is 85,205 and the last com number comes at the last and that is 1, 2, 2, 8, 5. So this is the smallest number and this is the biggest number and this is how you solve the question of descending order. See you guys in the next video. I hope you guys understood it. Uh, if you have any query or any question, just let me know and then we'll clear it out.